William Whalen here for GetMoreSports.com, looking again at what the Kentucky Wildcats need to do to get back to the Final Four, where they lost this year to Wisconsin. Now, it's the second straight Final Four for the Wildcats, yet another that Calipari has been able to accomplish while at Kentucky. Now, the question is, is this recruiting class that they have coming in on the same level as the ones that they've had in the past? And the answer is yes and no. Uh, they do have two five-stars, Scott Labassieri and I Isaiah Briscoe coming in. Uh, Charles Matthews is another top 100 guy out of Illinois, uh, a shooting guard wing, a fill it up from the deep kind of guy. Uh, but it doesn't have the same star power, maybe. Uh, the same names that just jump out at you that you've been following for years and years on the recruiting circuit. Now, that's okay for Kentucky, I think, because you have a guy like Tyler Eulis returning for his sophomore season to run the point guard spot. That You can move Isaiah Briscoe to the two if you want. You can run him at the one when, of course, Eulis has to sit on the bench. Lots of versatility there. Uh, you have Alex Poitras coming back. He can kind of mentor Charles Matthews, bring him along, fill in defensively when Matthews isn't ready. Then on the interior, you're likely getting Marcus Lee back, assuming that he doesn't transfer. I don't think that he will. This is his time to shine in Lexington. Uh, the real question here is if Dockery Johnson is going to go to the NBA, because if he does, then the presence of Scott Labissieri becomes even more important. If he comes back, then Labissieri can kind of kind of fit into college a little bit, get used to things. Like there's an adjustment period for absolutely everybody. Carl Anthony Towns went through it. I, I do think that Labissieri would benefit from that, uh, but I also think he's capable of taking over from day one. A lot of people, DraftExpress.com included, have moved him up to the first pick of the 2016 draft. Going to be very interesting to see next season at Kentucky. But as always, John Calipari has talent coming in for the Wildcats. Next year is no different. I expect to see them back in the fold late in the postseason.